Hey guys, Coach Brett Bartholomew here. I've worked with a lot of fighters, many of which succumb to rumors and myths that they always need some kind of specialty equipment, whether it's a certain kind of band to do a power exercise, uh, whether it's a certain kind of equipment for ESD or cardio or conditioning work. A lot of times fighters feel like they need to have these specialized routines or equipment in order to get the best results. You guys don't. Doing this simple thing savagely well means being resourceful, find what you have in your environment. Overload can take form in many different ways. Increasing the time under tension, uh, it, it can be heavier weights, it can be higher volumes, and it all depends where you guys are at within your preparation and your program in general. You can't follow the same kind of routine that a world champion does because what works for them may not work for you. Uh, you can't follow the same kind of routine that even worked for a buddy. Everybody's gonna be different in their level of, uh, or their needs for preparation, their deficiencies, their strengths, and all these pieces. But resourcefulness, being able to make the best and most use of your environment, just comes down to your creativity. I'll train many fighters out of my garage gym, what you see me filming out of here. And all we have is barbells, dumbbells, kettlebells. From a conditioning standpoint, we have a Versa climber. And I might have one or two specialty bars that I'll use if guys are dealing with injuries, but by and large, they come in and I modify the program based on what they need, what we have, and what's gonna get the job done. Guys, there's more than 35, even 50 years of research that shows the effectiveness of simple tools like kettlebells, dumbbells, and barbells. So please don't believe the hype. Look at programs that train basic movements, squat, push, pull, hinge, all these different things and allow you to overload them. I've had fighters that have done, gone without anything but uh, a weight vest and resistance bands. They can do resistance band push-ups. They can do rows. They can do loaded jumps or weighted jumps with the weight vest. These are guys that usually travel places that don't have access to gyms or they're away visiting family in remote locations, but they can find, that you can always find something. At the very least, you can take a backpack, fill it up with weights, so and you can do goblet squats with the backpack. We have a lot of these, uh, these exercises and a lot of these solutions for you in Savage and Simple. We've got to ignore the noise. When it comes to your fight, fight preparation, you have got to block out the rumors, the myths, the media, everybody that wants to divert your attention. At the end of the day, to be a successful fighter, you need to focus on the simple things done savagely well, and that's what my program is going to help you do. Hope to see you inside the program.